come to my bathroom. We're in my bathroom today and I hope it's not like too echoey, but today's video is gonna be all about my personal skincare routine to fade my scars because I do have a lot of scarring going on up here. I do have some actives because hashtag acne. I'm gonna work on my scars and I'm gonna show you how I do that with, of course, my banished products because it's the best like at home acne scarring fading system. It's a lot. You mostly have like red dots, you know, like hyperpigmentation. I do have um, indentations right here and also right here. By the way, if I do make mistakes, I'm sorry. Um, English is not my first language, but let's jump right into it. So the first thing I did, um, take off my makeup. I wash my face. It's clean now. This, that's why I look like this. I wash my face. And then the next thing I'm going to do is sanitize my banditry 2.0. I have my alcohol, not to drink because it's, you're probably going to die. Don't do that. Don't drink sanitizing alcohol. Okay, so I'm gonna take my banisher out of its beautiful packaging. And the cool thing about this is um, that it comes with the like cleaning container already. So what I'm gonna do is fill this up with my alcohol that is not for drinking. <laughs> and then let me do this real quick. Let's fill it up. This is almost empty. I have to get a new one at the pharmacy. Probably. So I'm gonna fill this up like so, and then I hope this is enough. I think it is. Fill this up and then I'm gonna take my beautiful banisher and I'm gonna just put it in there. And what this does is just make sure it kills all the bacteria um, and everything. And I'm gonna let that soak in there for about five minutes now. So we're gonna wait and then come back. Okay, so it's about 10 minutes later now because I took the banisher out of the alcohol and I waited for it to dry. And what I'm gonna do now is just work in sections. I'm gonna start on my right, yeah, for me it's a right, for my, on my right cheek. And I'm just gonna work in sections. So what you wanna do is just take this, press down and then turn it and then press down again. And you're gonna to wanna to do that like about five times, four to five times in each section. So. It does turn a little red. It doesn't hurt, by the way. A lot of people ask me this. It doesn't hurt. It, it You can feel it a little bit more on on your forehead, but it's not like you're gonna bleed to death or this like scare. It's not like a vampire facial or that scary stuff. Um, so I'm gonna just work in sections, press down, turn a little bit, and then press down. And I'm gonna do that now all over my face. Okay, that's about it. And then I'm gonna put this into alcohol again, just to, you know, sanitize it for the next time. And as you can see, my face is a little red. It does turn red um, after, but it, again, it doesn't hurt. It does feel like, a, uh, you can compare it to like a, like a mild sunburn or something, but it's not painful. It doesn't hurt. You're not gonna bleed or anything. And as you can see, I avoided the sections of my face where I have um, active breakouts. So this one right here, you don't wanna go over your active breakouts. So this one and then over here, like you don't wanna go over that. And then also don't do my forehead because I don't have really any like scarring on there. For me, it's mostly like my cheeks, as you can see um, now it's of course a little bit more red. Um, but yeah, my cheeks are basically my uh, problem zones, my problem areas. And what I'm gonna do now is immediately after, follow up with the banish oil. So it comes in this cute little dropper. Mine is a little crooked because I traveled, but it still works. So it comes in this dropper and I'm gonna drop just a little bit in my hand and then pat that onto my face. So just like right after, make sure that you pat it on. And this is what I do. Okay, beautiful. And then I'm gonna follow up also with the vitamin C cream from Banish. And it, it's, it's a, like a little tiny pot, but it's very, you get a lot, like, you don't need a lot. So I'm only gonna, I'm not, I don't mean to flip you off. <laughs> I'm only gonna take a little bit and then rub that a little bit in my hand and then I'm gonna also apply that. 
And I do apply it all over my face, just to like also moisturize my face because I just washed it. I'm gonna do that. And then the last step for me is I follow up with the vitamin C beauty elixir. And you're gonna want to close your eyes and your mouth because um, it has tea tree oil in it and you don't want that in your mouth. Like, that's, no, okay. And I love this, this is amazing. I also like spray this just randomly throughout the day to freshen up my face. I sometimes spray this on my pillow um, just because I like to be extra. Um, yeah, and that's about it. And now I'm gonna leave my banisher in the container with the alcohol for a little while. And then, you know, about like five minutes, and then I'm gonna take it out, wait for it to dry, and then put it back. So yeah, this is what I do at home to fade my scars. I never got like laser treatment or any like professional treatment for my acne scars. Actually, my mom was gonna give me, um, my mom was gonna take me to like laser and to go to a dermatologist to like get rid of my scars. And I said, I want to try out Banish first, and this is what I'm gonna do because laser is just, you know, it's expensive. And I just wanted to try something more at home and something that I can do um, myself. And I do this, this exact routine I do every week. So the Banisher 2.0, you can actually use every week. The roller, you can't use it every week, but the Banisher 2.0, you can actually use every week. And for me, that is perfect because I, as you can see, I have a lot of scars and it's just, you know, I had really, really bad acne for me, I think. I mean, obviously other people had had it worse, but I don't like to play that game. Um, I do have a lot of scars and I'm really like trying to fade them right now. So this was my nighttime, because I always do this at night. Also, side note, after this whole like treatment, after using the Banisher 2.0, you don't want to like apply makeup or go outside into the sun. So I like to do this at nighttime and then just have my skin like rest kind of for the night. So this was my nighttime skincare routine to fade my acne scars. And let me know what you think in the comments down below. Let me know what your routine is, what your favorite Banish product is, what you think of the Banisher 2.0 because it, it's pretty new and I personally love it. So let me know. Um, let me know if you have any questions. You can also hop on over to my Instagram. It's at skinwithleah and just DM me and let me know like your story because I love connecting with every Everyone and I love hearing like people's stories so if you have any questions feel free to leave them down below or message me on Instagram and I hope you have an amazing week day night whatever time it is in your country and I'll see you in the next video bye guys